Hey guys, welcome to Router 2 Brief. Uh, Sunday, sorry I didn't post a video yesterday. I do one every Saturday, but I have been so, so, so busy with video production. It's taken up literally every waking second of my life for the last two weeks. Um, I've been going to bed at like midnight or one in the morning working on uh, projects for clients. Uh, I've got a client coming over in about an hour and we're going to be probably in the editing suite for about nine to ten hours today. So there's just been no time and I feel bad for that, but just give you a little update on some other things. <clears throat> so here's Leia. She's finally chilling out. She is very chill, actually, most of the time. Um, eight week old German Shepherd. She'll actually be eight weeks in two days. Um, she's great, very compassionate. I'm going to start training her next weekend. I wanted to start this weekend, but there's been no time. Leia. Hi, baby. She's got beautiful markings. Um, tan, dark golden, and a black mask, of course. She's beautiful. She's very sweet. Hi, baby. Yeah, you're a good girl. Very soft. Yes, yeah, good. Baby, that's a good girl. Good baby. Very, very good girl. Um, love her. And uh, she's in Jack's bed right now. And uh, she will be outgrowing this bed in about four or five months. So I just ordered a new bed for her now. Um, let me take you over to the tank. Of course, we got Jack sleeping on the couch. He's getting along with her pretty well. Right, boy? You're tired, boy? This guy's tired? Yeah, it's a good boy. Puppies like to play and frolic and romp, and luckily, she doesn't do that too much. But when she gets in his personal space, he'll give her a little growl. So he's doing really good with her. No issues. And then, of course, we have the tank here. Um, I have to put some water in it. Because some's evaporated, which is why there's some micro bubbles, but you probably can't see them. Um, so what's going on with... I'm filming this with the iPhone 6, by the way, so it's a little more blue. See all the bubbles? I gotta put some water in there. I'm doing one and a half gallons a day, because one and a half gallons evaporates daily. I'm gonna do that once I get done making this video. But everyone's doing well. I got some bad news though, uh, my Atlantic Blue Tang that I just put in here died. I was just, I mean, no marks on him, he was in here, you know, no parasites, nothing, he was quarantined, everything's cool, everyone got along with him, never any fighting, um, but I, before bed I looked on my MP40 and he was laying on his side. So he was dead and then his body just rested on the MP40, kind of pulled him into it. Don't know how he died. He was eating, but not as well as the other guys. He was a little thin. After being in this tank for a couple weeks, um, he just passed away. So the corals are pretty small because I just turned the lighting on like literally five minutes ago. Not even. Star polyps are growing on the rock nicely. Now that they're just starting to come out, you can see that was the frag and they're starting to go across this part of the rock here. Zoanthus are really, I mean, I got it as like a, maybe a six head frag and it's just, in the course of a month, it was this big and now it's spreading on that other rock. It's, it's really growing fast, really spreading well. Um, so everything's just kind of waking up in the tank. Um, I love this coral from Coralust, this frag. I'm not sure what it's called, but I love it. Um, that's about it. The tank is doing really well. Unfortunately, my Atlantic Blue Tang died. I am not going to be replacing him because my Coal Tang passed away and I replaced him with the Atlantic Blue. I'm, I'm not going to put any more fish in here. I've got enough, as you guys know, my big tangs. Fowlery, fox face, naso tang, sailfin tang, yellow tang, and my clowns, five of them. So, ah, I hate the reflection in the tank. 
tank, but my next step is gonna be, as I said in a previous video, I'm gonna get some like limo tint and put four inches down of limo tint. Um, so that way when you're sitting on the couch, I said in a video a couple weeks ago, the light doesn't blind you because when it's blocked, it looks so much better, especially at nighttime. This isn't glaring in your face. So that's it. Sorry I didn't do a, a video on Saturday, but this will kind of count as one a, a little bit. The Fowlery, everyone's nice and fat. You don't get to see them truly because it's daytime, but there's some color. There's the fire shrimp. That's where he hangs out in the corner. Ah, oh, good, he's coming out. He's eating something, I'm not sure what that something is. But um, I have not seen my sand sifting starfish anywhere. I'm gonna probably go through my tank later and just gently go through the sand with a wooden skewer to see if I can see him come out from anywhere. There's a good shot of the guy. The two guys love these, the guys are getting big. How fat they are. Alright guys, I will talk to you later. Have a great weekend and a great week. I'll see you next time. Subscribe if you haven't already. Later.